Okay, and we're back. So, what we're going to do now is help out Vasco. So we're going to head back to the camp. Get Vasco back in the team. Let's go around here. Yeah, let's take these guys first. Spam our fury. See that little stand up attack they've got. I just can't, can't seem to dodge it successfully. We are getting low on ammo. What's that? Talking about ammo? Uh, yeah, we're getting low on ammo and traps. Maybe we need to get Vasco back in the squad. So I think it's just down here. Yeah, here we go. Vasco, buddy. Let's remove Kurt. Put Vasco in. Let's see what he's got to say. I'd like to know more about my family. I need to know what became of them. Could you accompany me to see Lady Morange? I'm afraid that without you, she may refuse to give me any information. All right, yep. let's go. Sort out. Let's go see Lady Loreen Morange. Okay, we can't make any ammo. Why does it never save? The uh, sorting. Completely fine for health potions. Poison, alcohol mix. Can't even make those. Alcohol mix of damage, we can't make them. Ours. We science level 2 to be able to make more traps. Right. Let's travel. So we can actually take care of the Constantine quest as well. Actually, while we're here, we should check out what's his face, uh, Vasco's equipment. That's pretty good. Should give him that, really. It's fine for everything else. Okay, we will speak to Constantine while we're here. And then we'll go deal with Vasco's shite. I thought he was getting down on, on his knees for me there. It's almost like about me. Where are you, mate? There he is. So Cousin! You have returned to me. Your absence was sorely felt. We don't appear to be in top form. A house intrigue's keeping you from finding proper sleep. No, nothing to bring me nightmares as of yet. I'm blaming it on the change of diet. Now, tell me what adventures you've been up to. If you only knew how bored I grow behind these walls. His parents? Any news of your parents? No. With the time it takes to travel to the continent, it's not surprising. But I don't miss them. 
My father's next letter will certainly be full of his usual disdain. As for my mother, you know her. She's probably too busy planning her next assassination to have noticed my absence. I'm what a bitch. We were not able, alas, to stop the clash between the forces of the Alliance and Siora's clan. We arrived at the village and the battlefield too late. The Queen fell. I'm extremely sorry for your loss, Princess. Thank you. My sister survived, fortunately, and we are recovering from this tragedy together. But our clan was extremely weakened by this battle and by recent events. We shall keep a close eye on the Bridge Alliance and their undertakings. Rest assured. You should know that the battle took place in the middle of ancient ruins. The ruins were quite strange. We discovered a fresco that I'm certain was crafted by continental hands. Really? And how ancient are these ruins? Could they date back to the first landings of the Bridge Alliance? They date much farther back than their arrival would explain. My mother and my grandmother have always known them. Siora told me of a legend that spoke of them, about a people from the sea that were vanquished there. Do you think it was the Norts? It is not our custom to found a landlocked settlement. We have our islands and it is enough for us. If they are ancient, perhaps your people once practiced older customs. This story uh, is be. troubling, but it reminds me of something that I once read in the reports of Lady Morange. You should go and find her. Perhaps she could tell us more about them. Very well. Uh, Anything please. else? We need to. I'm going to leave. Speak now. to Lady Morange. Goodbye, Constantine. Look out for yourself. Let's get the fuck out of here. Question Lady Morange. Lady Morange's house. Lady Morange's loot. Nothing. Siora. <laughs> Good day, Lady Morange. Do you remember me? Sir de Sardé, isn't it? I hope that you and your cousin have grown to like it here. But I have little reason to believe you have paid me a visit to exchange civilities. Can I be of service? What do you know about the ruins found to the northwest of here? <laughs> the site that the natives call Didakidnadagais. That is not how we pronounce it, but yes, we are speaking of the same place. <laughs> your language is difficult to master, but I find it fascinating. Uh, to answer your question, I had countless questions about the place when our explorers and scouts first brought back sketches. Intrigued, I went there. I noted the architecture and their decorations. It is certain that they bear a striking resemblance with continental constructions, but they are more ancient. Too old to have been recently built by the Bridge Alliance settlers when they first set foot on the island. I even questioned the natives, but they only spoke of a people of the sea. My first thoughts went to the Norts, but they're not known for building large towns, less so cities. There are other ruins on a cliff to the east of here. Perhaps they hide the key to this mystery. I hoped to organize an expedition, but the region is dangerous and hard of access. We explored so, right. at the bottom of we the need to head over there anyway. We're not able to find an access to the plateau. If the mystery of these ruins intrigues you as much as me, it is in that direction that you should begin to look for answers. Can I help you with any other matter? We would like to have some information regarding an important family, the Darcys. Well, I could tell you many things about them, but I suppose that you want to know something in particular? Are there any members of this family on the island? Indeed, Bastian Darcy, the son of the family, has been in New Serene for some time. Last I heard about it, he was doing business, but that doesn't help in knowing where he is. 
The Darcy's first attempt at establishing themselves on this island wasn't very fruitful, but I seem to recall that since then the Sun has found a competent associate who's been working here for a long time. Perfect. Could you tell us where to find her? Of course. Ask for a Madame Clerk near the warehouses on the port. That's where she normally is. I hope the Darcy's are not in trouble. Don't worry, madam. Their name was simply mentioned in some business discussions. We are thinking about becoming associates. We would like to know more about them to form an opinion. If you ask me, you should forget this idea, Your Excellency. Their <laughs> son is a poor business partner. Why do you say that? I do not mean to speak ill of him. Perhaps it would be better for you to form your own opinion. Well, thank you for your help, madam. Can I help you with any other matter? He's probably just terrible with decisions, or maybe he just can't put the count. Alright, so where do we need to go? Map. Okay. Come on, Vasco, boy. Oh, oops. Ah, I do actually need to see a merchant just to sell the shite I've got on me. Right, so... Sell all that. And all that, all of these. You're welcome, Omar. There she is. Can I help you? Are you here to do business? Are you Madam Clerk? We would like to meet with your associate, Mr. Darcy. Bastian? I don't know where he is. I can't say that he often graces us with his presence. You don't have the slightest idea where he is? I am not his caretaker, you know. You don't seem to hold him in high regard. Listen, my relationship with my associate is no one else's concern. And if you didn't come to do business, well... Yeah, that's we my charmer. This man you can see by my side is his brother. Do not insult my intelligence. I know that the Darcy's only have one son, alas. You can see the Nort tattoos on his face, can't you? And a merchant like you must surely know about the Nort's recruiting process. So it is true. The Darcy's gave away one of their children. I find it hard to believe. He was supposed to go to Hickman to deal with one of our clients, but I didn't receive any news from him after his departure. And given his tendency to get himself into impossible situations, I didn't try to get any. Who is this client? His name is Ferrat. You'll find him in the Alchemist District. Uh, I'll write this down. There's an you Alchemist think District? May have happened to him there. His mission wasn't very complicated. He had to pay for a valuable shipment and take charge of it. But with Bastion, anything is possible. Thank you, madam. Okay, so it looks like we need to head over here. Yes, yeah, so we'll take care of those two side quests. Well, we'll take care of all those quests, actually, while we're doing it. So again, we can say goodbye to New Serene for for a time. I'm gonna check. It. Have I gone past? Yeah, I've probably gone past it. <laughs> this is it. This is it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So we're gonna say goodbye to New Serene for a time. And is there any loot around here? Nope. Yeah, we go. Check out this new part of the island when we get the prompt is there loot over here? yes there is nom 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 Seems a bit strange to have this up here.
No, I'll let that thing live. Doesn't look like there's anything else up here. Well, I say that again. Something's definitely off around here. Where are we on the map? Why you should always explore. Oh shit, what's that? There's nothing we can investigate, but it looks like a big cave. I'm wondering if we're going to be sent back here at some point for a quest to do with a giant monster. I'm just not used to what. The, oh, I need a bit God of damn it. Yeah, I'm just not used to what the iron gathering sites look like yet. So I probably will run past quite a few, and I probably already have. I am just trying to keep my eyes open. Here we go. Time to travel. I think it's 12 hours. Can we sleep? Nope. I can get that, but only an extra 2 damage. Not worth it. This. Us oh, Claymore. Then again, the uh, Claymore, a uh, compare weapon. Which one is this comparing it with? Okay, so when it's got compare weapon B down there, it's actually comparing it with weapon A. So yeah, in terms of weapon A, I could get a cutlass. Let's do that. We'll sell. Oh, my clear equips it as well. That's good. What about gun? Oh yeah, we can use rifles now. Cause that damage, holy shit. Full barreled pistol. Oh yeah. Oh my god, I don't have I can't really use it. You tard. I'll keep hold of it. Grab those legs. Let's grab those. OK. 
Chase, looking good. Alright, let's give him that. And now we're out of cash. According to Lady Morange's instructions, the ruins should be in this area. The ruins should be in this area. So that's the mine. That's the tribe. That's Darcy's climb over there. So we're going to head down here first. Lady Morange told us about, but I do not know how to get there. The path collapsed. Some of the tunnels in the mine may lead to it. We should go there. Ah, oh, floating bushes. Come on. That should have been picked up. in the ass. I keep forgetting to sell all the all the junk items. Beasts. Let's see if we can stealth kill any of them. Ideally, you want to take out this one. Explode. Shit, I didn't kill him. Right. Oh, it's a dead guy. Oh, I, th I thought he would have given us like a, it's like a little quest to hand something back to someone. Or you find a ring on him or something like that. No. What is this place? Oh, you won't head there yet. That looks like a little. Yeah, it's a little village because we can see a crafter. Oh. It's just a 
chicken. Campsite. Sweet. Let's sleep until morning. Moine village. I'm here to steal all your shite. Good grief. These are some unusual customers. Greetings, my lord. It's a real pleasure to have a customer such as yourself. How may I help you? Right. Where's our junk? There we go. Oh, my feathers are just junk. Silver rings, sharp fangs, silver bracelets, hearts, mizor. So what what can she actually use? Ah, she doesn't need anything else there yet. We'll buy that cog. It looks like we need it. I imagine that your customers are mostly miners. Yes. For this reason, I mostly sell supplies and tools. But as you can see, I have some other riches. <laughs> I'm sure this village will eventually grow larger. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe this alley will become more lively. This isn't an alley. Thank you. It was a pleasure. This is not an alley. It's not even a gin or a snicket. Not even selling bread cakes. The people of the village might be able to teach us a few things. Good day. What can I do for you? What can you tell me about the ruins on the plateau? You aren't the first to ask me about them, but the answer is still the same. I've nothing to tell you. Not that I wouldn't want to, but I've never been there. There must have been a path once upon a time, but it's no longer there. Maybe it collapsed. Maybe. Some say that you have to pass through the mines to get there. A few of the tunnels do climb. It's certainly possible, I would say. But those tunnels are all closed, and we have better things to do. The iron ore. It doesn't come out of the ground by itself. Do you need anything else? Talk to me about the mines. It doesn't it seem that hard to get iron. All you need to do is They're walk really up to you know, the veins and press A. Those tunnels are full of riches. Don't even need a pickaxe. It takes little effort to unearth the minerals that we want. What more could we ask for? As seeing as how there aren't that many of us, if we were pressed to mine all the tunnels, we'd be too few. But the time will come when folks hear about what we're pulling from these rocks. We won't be alone for much longer. But well, we need to explore this place. We need to see what stuff they've got we can nick. So I've got a feeling that a lot of their stuff, and if we find any equipment, it's going to be just not useful for us. Or for the stuff we're carrying now. Hello, Your Excellency. How do you know that's me? Well, random to the attention of the miners. This is a call for donations. The mechanism of the old door that blocks the access to the mine was damaged, probably by one of us. We ask you to participate in this operation so we may buy the replacement parts that the merchant brought us. Ah, uh, yeah, blah blah blah. That's, that's the uh, replacement part that we were already bought. Okay, so that's to the mines. Let's go up here to grab that chest. Speak to this geezer. Your Excellency, it is an honor. Ooh, another chest. Yep, just robbing this village of its money. We we'll check out this side, and then we're we'll heading to the mines of Moria. Now we can't even go in here. Oh. What the fuck? That guy's clearly not a passerby. What the hell? Let's 
time to get into the mines. Oh, the darkest places you can turn on your lantern. Tactical pause. Explained it to right. I wonder if it runs out. What's up, user? You lost. No. Why do you ask? It's just that we rarely get visitors. Well then, what can I do for you? What can you tell me about the mine? It's ancient work. The natives must have dug it out a long time ago and then abandoned it. Even if it is strange work for islanders, it looks more like something we would do on a continent. We're trying to restore it. The rock is extremely rich in iron ore. But the tunnels are very old. Oh, there you go, the original go settlers slowly. that came over must have None of us are in the humour to be buried alive. We did explore a few of them, and we're exploiting the closest. But others, nah, they're still inaccessible. Anything else? What can you tell me about the ruins that we can see up there? Uh, not a great deal. To my knowledge, no one's ever been able to reach them. There it's were some officials today. from the city that came. But when they saw they couldn't easily climb up to the plateau, they just left. There must have been a path that caved in. Unless some sort of tunnel in the mine takes you there. Anything else? If I got this right, this hamlet is home to only miners? Yes. It's not been all that long that we've taken up residence here. For the time being, we've only been working a part of the mine because the veins run so deep in the tunnels. Hopefully, more miners will come, and that will attract other craftsmen to our village. We'll see. Anything else? No. I'll leave you to it then. See you we meet again. Right then. We've got a few directions we can go. So we need to go south. Let's go that way. So we're going to go the opposite direction. I want this place fully explored. There we go. <laughs> Looks like I found a quick way there. Science. I heard something up here. I don't know if we can get down there. See, we are going to have to come back and yeah, fully make our way around this place. With loads of loot, loads of experience. We just can't, can't just leave it. Oh, there's loads of iron ore as well. Ah, at least we can go back. Back that way now. So yeah, of course it wants to go this way. 
Are we gonna turn around? Oh shit! If anything, there'll be more materials down here. More ore, at least. Bit of poison on my brain. Let's go! Bitch. I still keep making the mistake of using my right analog stick to move the camera. Seeing any loot? There must be a way to open this gate somehow. I'll start just leave just there. Okay. Oh, we don't need to worry about that. We found the other way. Science way. Bit of poison on my blade. Then let's go. No, we've made it to the ruins. That was easy. I think Siora can equip this saber. Yeah, let's give her the saber. So if we have a look at the map, we didn't explore this little bit and all up here. It's another exit. It's a craft on us. Is that where we started? Yes, we started, so we didn't go this way or this way. But we will return one day. Don't play with me. Yeah, that's a nice view. Who wouldn't want to be able to see something like that? Like if you have like a little house around here, you step out and then boom. You got that. Without that weird line. What the hell is that? Can't get to the edge. Huh. Alright, never mind. Check out the ruins. I smash through this? Got a feeling there's gonna be a boss fight in here. Like a huge animal. Strange bits have an invisible wall. Finally, here we are. These are the ruins that Lady Lorene spoke to us about. I'll drown myself with the morning tide if these buildings were of native construction. Explore the area. 
Something may give away the identity of the architects. Okay. We shall fully explore. Professor Seraphidin. It was managed to observe one of the magnificent creatures who live on the seashore that had noticed it. The shell of this Nadig Glenderman seems to be as robust as a crab shell. And what a surprise it was to see that, despite its sheer size, it was capable of hiding in the ground in an instant, disappearing from my sight only to reappear further away. We have so much to learn from these noble creatures, it's easy to understand why their neighbors have worshipped them. That is going to be the boss fight. Or that over there, because that looks exactly like. Not exactly like. Uh, maybe that is. Yeah, that is the creature we just read about. Bit of poison on my blade. And I just saw its health. It's flipping out. Holy shit! It's got a fucking turret! Ah. I mean, poison it. Uh, poison? Is that a poison trap? Shit. Really, guys? It's underground. Nice, yes, attention. Let's see if you can ward off this fate. I'm needing tiny help. Come on, bitch. There you go, poison. Gosh, we still have a tiny damage to you. We've now run out of oh, exploding traps. Can't beat me, mate. Well, I thought we'd score the wolf. Wow. Me. Level twelve. Ooh, piece of the pearl from a prince of the sea. Oh, we can only sell it. That sucks. Have a chest. Ooh. Oh, well, it's worse than what we got. Yet again. What's the armor damage on it like? 40. Oh, what if we give it to. Yeah, give it to. Give it to Giza Face. And now, where's our character development? We've got one skill to use, and now we can actually get roll. Well, not yet. We need one more point. Get one more point to get poison weapons. Which I guess is that right? It allows the application of alchemical, alchemical preparations on weapons, which adds an effect to the following hits. Or we can increase traps. Armor damage, 50%, really good. Magical damage was 50%. That's the magical one. Allows the recovery of ingredients near the location. That would be useful as well. However. I'm going to wait till the next level to get that. I've got nothing to grab here. Okay. Is this one of the areas we need to search? Yeah, it is. It's going to be through this little bit. See? Old and almost illegible journal. Top 
position on the island is becoming impossible to hold. Despite our best efforts and the many battles we have won, we are losing more and more ground. These savages are formidable opponents. The roots seem to obey them, and they are helped by gigantic creatures the likes of which we have never seen before. The creatures are approaching and we are incapable of facing them. The lords are already preparing to board the ships that the Norts had stationed in our position. As I expected, they said they would not be enough room for everyone. You are going to die here, stopped by some giant raging monsters. Cursed be the princes and everything. So we know the this Norts came confirms in. what we suspected. A continental nation had once attempted to colonize the island with the help of the Norts, and they were repulsed. From what I was able to decipher, few of them actually managed to escape. I should have known as soon as we discovered those ruins that we were not foreign to these lands. Hmm. The major part of the journal has faded, and I'm not able to decipher the name of the author. Let's continue our search. We must discover which nation was here. Yep, yeah, and we shall continue the search. So, as always, guys, so be actually. So, as always, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.